Hey everyone, welcome to Android Studios. Um, so I told you guys I know how to do some of Android programming. So for apps and everything, so this is what this is. Anyways, moving on. The error about could, could not get unknown property, this OSER username for object of type. Now this is where the problem lies. In order to, let's say you don't know where that problem is. What you can do is you can just right click and just jump to the source and it'll jump you to that. And let's, let me try, let me, let me show you guys. Like, let me go to a different window. See, I'm in manifest right now. And then I just right click and then jump to the source and then bam, it lets me know where the problem is. All right, so to fix this problem, what you need to do is change out this, the user, OSER, OSER username to find property. Um, let me just, let me just uh, paste this. So before I say it, okay, you'll change it to find property, no space between that. And then you do um, parentheses, um, this, Thing right here it's like not a quotation mark but a um i said i guess a half quotation mark and then put the oser username between those two and then end it with a half quotation mark and a parentheses and then you do the same thing for the other one you do find property and same thing be sure that at the end of this you keep the parentheses so prior to that, let me let me con uh, undo that. Prior to that, you see how there's only one parenthesis closing it all in. See that? Well, make sure that when you do uh, fix it, that you actually keep that parenthesis there. So it has to be two at the end. Okay, that's very important. And now you're going to the next thing. See how snapshots respiratory has the OSER username? You do the same thing. Find property, uh, parentheses, and then just like that, and then do the next one. Again, keep that parenthesis at the end. All right, you're done, right? Not quite. You got to sync this. So you can, your sync should already be there. If it's not, you can always go to go all the way up to the top of your uh, computer, and it should say built or run. And then just click run or built and or or even exit out and then open the Android studio back up and it should work. So I'm going to sync this right now and it will probably take a while, a few minutes or so. So don't, you know, don't panic. Don't be in too much of a rush. Let it be. Um, mine's is working pretty fast because I already fixed it, but um, yours might take a little bit longer than mine. If you guys have any other errors, let me know. I can help you out. Uh, or we can try to figure it out together. And thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, um, and share.